Okay, my, my name is Faisal Fouhaid and I'm a 17 year old, born and raised in Kuwait. Uh, currently I'm studying at the Gulf University for Science and Technology in my freshman year. Okay, so basically I'm a social activist and I have this project called Equate where it focuses on equality in Kuwait, whether it be with the older generation or the younger generation because what I went through in my earlier life is that I was bullied regularly because my, I read a lot and my English was relatively stronger than my Arabic and I usually get a lot of stick for that. And basically what I'm doing with Equate is like not focusing on those that are on the short end of the stick or the, those people that deal with these problems and highlight what they're going through. Like, this, for example, the stateless citizens, they graduate from school, they can't go into any jobs, they don't earn any income, they have to like go on the street and sell pinwheels. And that's just sad. And what I hope to achieve with Equate is that I want to educate my country about the how bad it is to value a person that goes through what they go through and I believe that through film with the popularity of cinemas in Kuwait these days I believe that the message will get across perfectly through that. So you're now creating a short film about it, right? Um, not exactly a short film, it's more of a bigger documentary on an hour long but at the end of the day it gives out the same message and as long as the message is put across, whether it's a short film or a documentary, that's, what's, that's what counts. Okay, uh, my dad represented the Kuwaiti delegation in New York during the Gulf War. And he usually tell me stories about his experience working in the, as a delegation of Kuwait in the United Nations. And I was really interested by it and that helped me get into MUN. I thought, if my dad could do it, why can't I do it? And I went in with no, <laughs> no public speaking skills, but as I progressed from conference to conference, I believe that I improved greatly in my public speaking skills, and that led me to go on to bigger and bigger, better things. For example, in AOK I mean, back in 2009, I became a runner-up in my commission, and that was a huge achievement coming from a guy that didn't have public speaking skills at the time. And then a year later in Pearl MUN, I got most hardworking delegate in the Air Security Council Commission. And then a year later, my, in my opinion, my biggest achievement was getting most outstanding delegate in the Environmental Commission at Case in 2010. And uh, then in 2011, I did the IAM MUN, which is a more international, comp uh, international conference. And it was a relatively big step up for what I'm used to in Kuwait. But in the end, I got an honorable mention, and I'm in the end happy with that, considering that people from Madagascar and Bahrain, they attended the conference, and I held my own there. Um, I don't tend to obsess about the future so much, because I really need to focus on finishing this documentary right now. Because we only start filming tomorrow, and we start our first interview tomorrow. And I tend to focus on finishing what I have now in the present and then when that's all said and done, whatever happens, happens. So I prefer to focus on the present. But be yourself because I try to conform with the general contingent in my school and trust me, it got me nowhere. I was miserable and I felt like every single day, no matter what I did, nothing was working. And I just thought one day, I don't have to be like this. I have to be my own guy and I need to ha have a voice in order to succeed in life. And with that, it got me to the point where I am now today. Like Global Change Makers, the Global Youth Summit, and all the volunteering opportunities I've gotten involved in. And I'm really proud of making that decision about being my own person. And trust me, if you become your own person, great things will happen to you. That's all I gotta say. Um, we've, I've got two Twitter accounts, at uh, Equate, E-Q-U-A-I-T, and at FLFuhaid, which is my, my Twitter account, and also my email, fmlfuhaid at gmail.com. And so yeah, if anybody has any questions or queries about this project, or if they want to help out in any way, they can come, feel free to contact me. 
Hi, I'm Faisal Fuhaid and you're watching me on thinkup.ae.